Okay, here we go. 2021 Topps Chrome Platinum Anniversary. This is the hobby box. There is a light box, which is not guaranteed an autograph like the hobby box here. These run, oh, I was gonna say around 150 to 160 dollars, I would say. Pretty much, if you haven't seen this, one of the best designs. It is the 1952 Topps design. This product is absolutely sweet, guys. There's parallels in here. I had to go get a box as soon as I saw it. And if you need the odds, let me peel the back here so we can get that. They don't have the odds on the box. All right, so you should be able to pause the video right there if you'd like. There's all kinds of parallels, but let's get ripping. This is exciting. Let's get these in the back here. Actually, let's pull all these out first. I, it gets a little messy trying to grab packs out of a, a box when you got packs or cards laying in front of you. All right. Really curious who our auto is going to be, but look at this product. If I can make it happen. <laughs> Willie McCovey, Stretch, starting us off. We already do have a refractor in the back. This is just, it's the 52 design, the inaugural 70 years. Beautiful cards, all chrome. And even these singles will do well because it's a very desirable set. We only have, oh, we do have, okay. I've heard Rafael for Kyle, Craig Biggio, and Elvis Andrews is our first refractor. So we'll get a little parallel pile right there. Even some of these singles just of bigger players if you were collecting back in the 90s you know late 80s 90s like i was this set will appeal to you far as players back then the nostalgia factor they even have all the way back to the 50s players in here the problem is it's going to be obviously the 2021 rookie class on here and so far that class isn't doing anything too crazy currently at the moment. Nice Nolan Ryan. Hopefully that's just glue, it is. Um, oh, it's easy, easily to wipe off. I'll check it over later. But some of these cards are gonna be fun to grade. You just gotta obviously get it centered up, but that is just a sweet looking Nolan Ryan refractor right there. Actually, let's just throw it in a sleeve for right now. Yeah, this product, it's all portraits pretty much, but I mean, it's its beautiful. As soon as I saw this product, I was like, oh, I got to get my hands on this stuff. It screams nostalgia, screams modern, ultra modern, you name it. Well, let me cover your refractor. Nice one there. Very well centered too. Yeah, this product's going to be pretty well off from years to come. There's nothing like it before. So, these packs for sure just kind of fall apart on you. <laughs> kind of a funny smiling picture of Ryan Sandberg there. But Mitch Moreland, I guess, is kind of a current player. It's not a portrait design. Roger Clemens, big name there. And Sam Huff. Gonna be another rookie so we only acquired two rookie cards several refractors but this product is <laughs> as i keep on re repeating here this is just fun to open i could open this all day will clark i just saw on ebay his super refractor sold yesterday unfortunately i think it went for like 350 or something I want to say. If you don't know by watching these videos, that was my favorite player growing up. Kershaw, not so much. All right. I'm not quite sure how much on average parallels hit. They definitely do hit. Mark McGuire. Reese Hoskins. Prime time. 
Lee, Mazzoli. No rookie cards or refractor color in that pack. Oh, spun it around and saw. We do have color, obviously, in this one. Alejandro Kirk's not a bad one. He's doing pretty well this year. Johnny Cueto in his Giants uniform. Haven Smith. And Carlton Fisk out of 75 is going to be maybe what, like a pink or magenta speckle. Let me see if I can. Might be rose mini diamonds on this. I don't, I should have had the parallels list next to me, but if this is rose, which it would be. Uh, it's one out of 109 packs. So, numbered out of 75, not a bad one there. Continuing on. I guess I could put, since there's no, normally I have rookie cards, parallels, and inserts, but there's not going to be any inserts. So we'll do all of our refractors and then our colors on the far right. Even some of these packs out. Yeah, let me know what you guys think of this product. I, I feel like, I just felt like, hey, a lot of these guys I used to collect and they're not in cards anymore. And this 700 card set, Tommy LaSalle in a Oakland uniform, and Fergie Jenkins. I say a lot of these players used to collect and they're just not in sets anymore. And this has everyone, basically, <laughs> huge list the auto list is just absolutely phenomenal i'm having a horrible time opening these cards for whatever reason <laughs> ron santo walker bueller mitch white is another rookie we're hitting and xander bogarts all right let's hit the middle middle stack first Sorry, I was just out driving, so my hands are like sticking to everything on these packs to get them out of here. Johnny Bench, just sweet players like that. It's fun to see. You just mix everyone mixed in. Jared Weaver, Matt Foster, Roldis Chapman. I mean, I know current sets and product also mix in their their old school players, but not like this. It's just kind of a different format. Um, you know, this is obviously celebrating 70 years of tops. So it just, there's a little bit more doing it right kind of in this set, I feel like. Especially with the, the 52 design. Everyone is on it. It's not like just mixed in as inserts or anything like that. Every single card is that way. There are no inserts. At least to my knowledge, I could be wrong saying this, but I'm pretty sure there's no inserts. All right, Colton Wong, Joey Lucchesi, <laughs> Greg Maddox with the glasses, and another refractor is going to be Pete Fairbanks. All right, so let's even these packs out. Merrill Kelly. Timmy, Mike Moustakis, and Hansler Alberto. So not seeing too much crazy color or giant stack of rookies coming out of this box for sure yet. All right, Jackie Bradley Jr., Marcelo Zuna, Ted Williams, nice one there, and Ichiro Refractor. Very sought after player. Let's get him. This is an older Ichiro. You can kind of just tell, I believe. Seems like it. All right, we're gonna go right. I think after this, those, what is it? Six stacks we got left? I can't tell. Or nine. Just one or the other. All right. David Ortiz, this card got Demolished, and that was not for me trying to open it. it seems a little rough, actually. It's the first one I've seen where there's quality control issue there. 
Tommy Fam. Ooh, on Tommy Fam. And Ron Geardy is our refractor for this one. So we still got an auto coming up. And I'm guessing, so we got, yeah, nine packs left. A lot of packs, definitely. To say at least, what is it, 20? I think it was 24, 24 packs, four cards per pack. You do the math on that. A Daniel Johnson, two rookies in this, and Mark Matthias. I've also seen packs where there's more cards than four per pack. I'd say more cards, more more packs, more than four cards, however you want to say it. Daryl Strawberry, <laughs> young Daryl Strawberry, Hoyt Wilhelm, Joe Adele, trying to still pan out, and Lucas Sims. All right, after this, we have six more. Edwin. <laughs> Carnacion, can't speak all of a sudden. Luis Alexander Basabe, Nate Pearson, and Aaron Fletcher. Three rooks in that pack. All right, we're getting down to it. We are definitely getting down to the wire on this. Only one color, which is surprising, which I just flashed some more. I don't know if you saw it on the screen, but I certainly did. Oh... It is my favorite player. I'm just running for it. Out of 199, a Will Clark blue speckle, I'm going to say that is, or foil. I'm not quite sure what term they're, they're saying. I have this little pack on the side. Let me see. Blue, blue, blue. I'm looking for blue. It's not an aqua wave. I don't even see blue in here. Blue mini diamonds, there it is. One out of 41 packs. One every 41. So, nice little gift there. Favorite player hitting. I will take it. Continuing on down the line here in the back. We are still looking for Something without a facsimile signature. Bob Lemon, Jose Ramirez. We have another blue. This one wasn't flipped. There's our auto, Eddie Rosario. Almost color matching. I just love how the autos are basically removing the facsimile and replacing it with an on-card auto. Obviously not our best auto the pen is color matching to the blue so at least the auto did hit out of 99 so we'll get that sleeved up real quick i'm not quite sure how tough the sign auto checklist is huge so that's pretty much what you're going after with these the autos i have a feeling are going to be very 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 big on the secondary market, but see if we can find anything else in here. A Dane Dunning rookie card. John means Dansby Swanson. All right, final three packs. Assuming there's gonna be some more color out of here. Orlando Cepeda, Joe Torrey, Nick Neardit, and Sean Yamaguchi. Sean Yamaguchi. Someone's knocking on my door. So let me hurry up this. A green wave of Zach Polesky and the final pack. going to be Vlad and an X-Fractor of Goose Gossage. So, 
that is your 2021 Platinum Anniversary. Here's all the base. You get an idea. Rookie cards, refractors, and color. So thanks for watching. Hopefully you enjoyed the video. Got you a little idea of what to come out of this product. Check it out. Very fun to rip. Take care. Thanks for watching. Have a good one.